Hi everybody, this is John Magician Dads, and we're trying to get me out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, so I can meet up with everyone out in New York, New Jersey. We're all trying out for the Ultimate Fighter, the season that's coming up with 35 and 45 Ultimate Tryouts. So we meet Diego Brandel, Frankie Gomez, Matt Label, and Travis Mars. We're all going to be doing, uh, doing amazing things and making sure that we can make sure that we secure one spot for the 135 and 145 uh, positions. So, I'm still stuck in Albuquerque. I was, I was stuck on standby throughout the whole day, and they said that I might not even have a ticket. There's no guarantees because it was booked solid from my from the earliest flight that I had till next until tomorrow, which is Monday, tryout day. Ugh. But my brother actually somehow managed to give me a ticket to fly out at two o'clock and get there at one o'clock in the morning. This day is just not going the way I wanted it to. So. This is my younger, bigger brother. Hi. <laughs> He's the one who's helping me out, making sure that I'm going to be up on the trials, on time, and be on there. Be yeah. there. He's the one who actually helped uh, pay for it. He's my number one sponsor, my number one big fan right now. <laughs> well, Eric, thank you for all your help, man. You should. I know that. You don't want to see me get my ass kicked, and you definitely want me to go out there and beat somebody's ass, right? Absolutely. <laughs> Alright, it's 2.33 here. I'm here with me, Matt, oh, and little looking Travis. Travis. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, Frankie and Diego have that over room right now. And As of an hour ago. <laughs> just an hour. Yeah, just an hour ago, Frankie and them just got a room. And we've all been crashing out. Oh, they've been crashing with Here's this. some dude named Will that we... <laughs> some dude. We picked up the lobby. Will's from Oregon. Yeah. He jumped on in the lobby. Hey, Will. Just let him wait your way. I'm Lil John. Pleasure to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah, he's but, the one we've been waiting on, bro. Yeah. So, we've been sitting here with all this hassle. I I think I could have swindled the guy, the taxi cab driver, from 80 bucks to 40, but I didn't. I should have. Because he was hating life way more than I was. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody else back at home was probably wondering what the hell is going on. Jahani's killing me, and Ali, I'm definitely going to try to kill just let you know. <laughs> but I'm going to let you know how everything goes in the morning. We'll get a little bit of sleep and we'll wake up and we'll see everybody outside. So it's morning time. We have one more back in to add an entire little family. Frankie Gomez. Uh, we're waiting on Diego, but we don't know where our crazy Brazilian brother is at. <laughs> it's early as in the morning. Pile into an elevator. On, With some cats that we all been trying to do. Yeah, I do remember. It's all good. Go ahead, Nana Greg. Yeah. So the line goes from here. <laughs> With all these other guys behind me, still walking towards the front. Keeps on walking. Pretty much goes all the way to the back. We are currently walking down. Me and Frankie. Everybody. And it goes all the way up down to the end of the hall. Boom has actually decided to kick it in with us. You want to say a few words, Boom? What's up, guys? This is Mitch Fadi. The Jacks are going to make everybody inside the house. We're going to throw down inside the house. Yeah, yeah, what he said. 